What's up, guys? Today I am back with the next video on Graves.js integration, with React, Node, and Mongoose. Till now, we have designed our home page to show the list of all pages on it. We also created a form to create a new page. So let's start. <music> We need to install Oxios to communicate with our previous application. Let also run the app which contains all the API. That application will run on 8080 port. Let also add that project in versus code. So that we can easily check what we have and how we can use API to make our React dynamic application. Our server has been started successfully on port 8080. Let's see Oxios has been added or not. Now, let's create an API util that will have all of the API related changes. I am going to create a variable to store the server address so that we don't have to change it everywhere whenever we are making an api call in case we change the server or api these are the api related to page like create page list pages change page content etc We already have pages reference and also we iterated over it to create a table entry. I am going to use use effect, a react hoops to make an API call to the server. If you don't know about use effect or any other reacts hook then please let me know. I will create a video on that. Now let's create a function to make an API call inside use effect hook. I am going to use async and await with Oxios. Don't forget to import Oxios in the home component. Async await will help us to wait until we get repos either success or fail from server. Make a get call to load all the pages from server or database. Store the response from Oxios to response variable. Response.data will have all the pages. So store it into pages. Add missing import of API host which we have created in API utils.
Now trigger get all pages function inside use effect to get it worked. I am just going to create one more state to store any error from API. By mistake we have used this when we are iterating over a list of pages. But we created page reference. So let's fix it. Also in React we have to use key and parent element. So let also add it. Finally we have listed our pages from server on React. There are some other minor issue which can be ignored. But I am going to fix it. If you don't want to do this, you can move to next section. Let's show error on new UI which we may get when we are trying to get list of pages from server. Now let's see a quick demo. Import link from React Router DOM and change the link with this in Pages table. Now we are going to work on creating a new page. So let's create a method to send a request from React application to server to create a page. I am going to name it create page. We will use Oxios post call to create a page and we only need to send the name of the page which we want to create.
Now let call the method, in our home component which we just created. We will store the response in, new page variable, pass name in the method which we received from input field. Since we are using a wait so we also have to make our handle submit to async. Now set name to empty. Also, let update our page variable to store this newly created page. I am creating a new array by expanding the old one and adding a new element in the last. Now let's have a quick demo. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.